What is up everybody, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to download the Monkey Map Loader, which just released yesterday, and I'm going to teach you guys how to download it. We are going to be heading over to the Gorilla Tag Modding Discord, link in the description, and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to download any map for Quest and Quest 2. You're going to want to find your way to Quest Mod Releases, where you can find the Monkey Map Loader. Now you're going to want to scroll down because there was an update. You want to scroll down and download the latest version of the Monkey Map Loader. You can click download right here and it will download in your default web browser. Now while that's downloading, we can go download anything from the custom maps area we can scroll up and down we can find all these maps that we want to download you can click download right here if you want to download them there's so many of them you can download them and just choose the ones you want i'm going to download the few that i want all right i have downloaded the mods that i want now to download these onto your headset we need to have the quest patcher which we can get in the quest mod releases scroll up find quest patcher and get the latest version of the quest patcher now i have a tutorial on this link in the description and somewhere on screen um and you can watch that tutorial to download the quest patcher used to download all these mods you're going to want to find all of your monkey maps and your monkey map loader and you're going to want to plug in your headset now, with our headset plugged in and our quest patcher opened, we're going to find all of our mods that we downloaded from the Gorilla Tag modding discord. You need to install the monkey map loader by dragging it over onto the quest patcher. Now, you need to do this first before you install any of the custom maps. It's okay that it says force uninstall library, that is supposed to be there. Now that we've done this, we can drag any of the custom maps that we downloaded onto the quest patcher which lets us download it now i'm gonna do all of my mods that i downloaded and i'll catch you guys once i'm in vr all right guys we're back in vr now this just teleports us back to the main area we don't want that it's red we have to select the map we want to go to first so we're going to go to the map loader setting in the computer and we see all of the maps that we have downloaded now you can see which one you have selected right now in the little sphere there and we just want to click enter whenever we find a map that we do like and what this does is it selects the map that we want and then we click enter one more time and it'll activate our teleporter pod as you can see here we're gonna we're about to activate it and once this turns green it means we can teleport to that map that we have selected we stand on it and we teleport to that map now standing on it you, means you have to put your hand on the teleported pod itself you can't just stand on it with your hands in the air you can exit the maps by finding these spots in various locations over the maps to exit and teleport back to the computer and teleporter pod where you can continue to go to different maps download too many maps and they're not appearing on screen just use the left and right arrow keys to cycle through different pages use up and down to select and you can find all of your maps and so i really do hope that you did indeed enjoy and that this was a useful tutorial and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye